It's a rainy afternoon in Sour Lake, Texas, but for the Hart Jefferson Hawks, there's still plenty of work that has to be done. After a slow start to the season, HJ has come on strong of late, winning five of their last seven ball games, including the district opener against Tarkington. Some of the highlights include an impressive 2-1 win over state-ranked Silsby and a no-hitter thrown by Grayson Cash. Cash leads a strong pitching staff that has given the players and fans plenty of optimism. We need to improve on some little things, that's all. But other than that, we're doing we're where we need to be right now as a team. I think the best part about this team is that we all get along so well and like each other so much that we just like being around each other and have fun playing together. I feel like we're headed in the right direction. We have a lot of room for improvement, but uh, we want to be our best at the end, not at the beginning of the season. Right now, I think we're sitting pretty good. We beat a couple of the top 25 teams in the state. Uh, we won our first game in district. Heading into next week, I think we have a good chance at being first. While the team enters district play on a roll, there's much more to what's going on that meets the eye. Head coach Ed Trotter is instilling good habits that include a strong work ethic and accountability, important traits that will serve his players well beyond their time at Hart Jefferson. I like teaching life lessons like this. This game is about life lessons. It's it's the ups and downs, it's pushing through stuff, being on time. We have a lot of rules uh, that honestly they have to do more about having a job, showing up on time, doing your work. Not all of them are going to play college baseball at the next level. They're going to graduate, some are going to get a college degree, some are not, but they're all going to be in the workforce and they got to learn how to work. The players are hoping and believing that strong work ethic will help take them to their ultimate goal. Our goals, we want it all. We're going to work hard every day, do all that we can so we can uh, be in Austin at the end of the season and we can uh, take it all home with us. To be in Austin this year to play for the state championship, that's, one, that's our main goal. I've had the opportunity to play in the regional finals, regional semis, uh, several 21 seasons, and I always set goals high. It, uh, I don't want to set them low. Our goal is go, like everybody's goal is go to Austin, play in the state championship. Uh, everybody likes talking about winning the district championship. I'm not much of that guy. Uh, district championships are great, but we always want to set our goal high, and that's going to Austin and winning the state championship.